This tutorial will show you how to download an ebook to your Kindle or device with Kindle software. To get started, go to the Harrison Public Library website at harrisonpl.org. To go to the Digital Media Catalog, click Download Audiobooks Ebooks below the menu on the left. This takes you to the Digital Media Catalog. It's a good idea to log into your account first because your home library may offer additional titles that you can only see when you're logged in. To log into your account, click Login from the menu on the top right. From the login screen, enter your library card number. And your PIN, which is typically the last four digits of your phone number and click Login. This takes you to your account page where you can download titles you already checked out and see titles that you are waiting to become available. You can reach this page later by clicking My Account from the menu. To search for an ebook, return to the home page by clicking Home from the menu on the top left. You can search for an ebook a number of different ways. One way is to use the search form at the top right of the screen. Enter a title or an author into the search field. Click the drop down box and select Kindle Book to limit your search to titles that are compatible with Kindle and click Go. You can also browse by categories such as New York Times bestsellers or new releases. Keep in mind the home page may include media other than just ebooks, such as audiobooks. You can also scroll down and use the menu on the left. Hover over ebooks to browse by category, or click ebooks to browse the ebook collection. When you select a title, you need to look at the format information to confirm the title is compatible with Kindle. If it says Kindle Book, then the title can be downloaded to the Kindle. If the title is available, you will see Add to Cart on the right. If it is not available, you will see Place a Hold. When you place a hold, you will be notified by email when the title is available for download. To start the checkout process, click Add to Cart. This adds the title to your cart, where you can remove the title continue browsing for more titles, or if you are ready to check out, click Proceed to Check Out. From the checkout screen you can confirm your selection. Click the drop-down box to select your lending period, which is typically one or two weeks. You can set the default lending period for future checkouts from your account page. If you are ready to check out, click Confirm Checkout. This takes you to the download screen. Click Get for Kindle. This takes you to Amazon.com. If you are not signed into your Amazon account, you will see Get Library Book on the right. If you are signed into your Amazon account, you will also see Deliver To. In this case, I've downloaded the Kindle app to my iPhone, which is free from the iTunes App Store and Android Market. By the way, you can also use the free Kindle Cloud Reader to read library ebooks on your PC, Mac, iPad, or Linux computer. Select your Kindle device from the drop down and click Get Library Book. If you are not already signed into your Amazon account, just click Get Library Book. You will need to sign into your Amazon account to continue. Enter your email address. and Amazon.com password and click sign in using our secure server. Select your Kindle device from the drop down box and click continue. The next time you sync your Kindle by connecting to the internet the title will download automatically and you are ready to read. If you have an older Kindle and it does not have Wi-Fi or 3G there are a few additional steps. Click Manage your Kindle from the menu on the top right of this screen 
or from your Amazon account drop-down. On the right you will see the drop-down actions. Hover over Actions and select Download and Transfer via USB. Save the file to your computer, connect your Kindle with USB to your computer, and move the file to the Documents folder on your Kindle, and you are ready to read.